It's a site that's had devastating consequences that severed BP well spewing millions of gallons of oil into the Gulf. Experts, though, say a similar disaster may take place in the same waters, a potential disaster that no one is checking on. We don't know what's going on out there in our own waters, and that is an unacceptable situation to be in. The situation revolves around abandoned oil and gas wells that companies leave behind when they're done exploring or producing with them. While these platforms are a visible sign of Gulf oil production, it's what's below the surface that has some scientists concerned. There are 27,000 of them dotting the Gulf and some date back to the 1940s. You're looking at wells that are just onshore but are being capped like those underwater. Such wells are supposed to be permanently sealed off with hundreds of feet of concrete, but experts fear that the material can erode away or be incorrectly applied or that some owners might skimp to save money. Well, the plugs, I, the, the big question is how long does cement last and how to take it to, for it to oxidize. We don't actually know that even for our buildings. Nor do we know exactly how many abandoned wells are leaking and how much oil is getting into the water. Companies have been tracking oil spills for some time. You can see them here in this satellite image. But most of these are presumed to be from natural leaks that occur all the time in the Gulf and not from abandoned wells. But experts say that doesn't mean the wells aren't seeping. The, the cement that you have in the casing, it could shrink, it could age. And if you're not using a property of cement, it could crack. And so it, it could become a weak, weak point. One problem is no one, neither the government nor the oil companies, routinely inspects abandoned wells. The ideal thing would be to have a separate independent group that are professional in doing this thing here. Back in 1994, the General Accounting Office warned that unseen leaks from abandoned wells hold the potential to cause environmental disaster. However, experts say that disaster probably won't appear like the BP well that's gushing into the Gulf, but rather in small slicks that over time could have the same effect. Mike Gracia, The Associated Press.